First, let's look at living things. What are living things? Living things need water, air, and food to live. Living things need three things to live. They need water, air, and food. Animals and plants are living things. That's what living things need, okay? As opposed to non-living things. Non, of course, means not. Not. Not living. Not living means that they're not alive, right? It means non-living things do not need water, air, or food. Rocks and water are examples of non-living things. They're not alive, right? They don't have bodies, right? They don't have parts that move, right? These are other examples of non-living things. A football, a basketball, a baseball. Those things are not alive, right? They don't live. Uh, they don't breathe. They don't reproduce. They are not living things. They are non-living things. All things, whether they're living or not living, they live in a place. What do we call that place? We call that place the environment. The environment. This is the place where a living thing lives. But of course, it's all the place. It's also the place where you can find many non-living things too. But an environment, usually we talk about, uh, when we talk about living things, we talk about their environment and the relationship between living things and the environment. Survive means to continue living. Living things, of course, one of their main goals is to continue to survive, to continue to live. Continue living to keep living, stay alive. They, of course, want to stay alive. So living things want to survive. A living thing needs water, air, and food to survive. If they don't have water, no air, no food, they cannot survive, right? In that case, they die, okay? If all those types of things die, then they are no longer, they, they go extinct. Look at this flower right here. This flower is growing up. It needs water, air, and food in order to survive. If you take away water, the flower will die. No air, the flower will die. Uh, no uh, food and the water, the flower will die. So all living things need to survive. They need these things in order to keep living, to continue living. To grow. Of course, all living things grow. That's another thing about living things. Not only do they survive, they need to survive, they also need to grow. Living things change from very small babies to adults to very old and then they die. This is what happens to living things. It's the cycle of life, right? The cycle of life. All living things grow through the cycle of life. Grow means to get bigger. That's the basic word, right? To grow, to get bigger. If you have food and water, you will grow, right? Food, water, and time, you will get bigger, right? All living things. This is a good example here. We can see different stages of the development of this plant. This plant, as it grows, it gets larger. Let's take a look at this, these plants here that are planted in this pot here. Let's take a look at how they grow. Wow, look at that. They're growing very quickly. Of course, this is a trick photography. This video was taken over a long period of time, but the plants are growing. They are getting bigger, getting bigger. They are growing in size. And of course, they're growing in age too. They are getting older. So when things grow, they get older. When you grow, you get older. So things grow, they get bigger, they also get older. And this is part of the cycle of life. Okay, let's talk about non-living things. A rock is an example of a non-living thing. A rock is a small and hard non-living thing. This, for example, is a rock. Now it says small, but of course some, some rocks can be big, right? But uh, this, this little rock here that you can pick up off the ground, it's small, it's hard, right? It's very tough, 
and it does not live. This rock, it doesn't need water. It doesn't need food. It's not going to grow, right? It's not going to get bigger by itself if you give it food and water. That's, that's crazy, right? So the rock will stay the same unless you hit it, unless water uh, changes it somehow. But usually by itself, it will not grow. It will not change by itself. Now, nature, right? Nature is where all the things exist. Nature is the world of living and non-living things. So living and non-living things exist in nature. When you go out into nature, right, you have, you have grass, you have trees, you have air, you have clouds, you have sunlight. Some of those things are living, some of those things are not living, non-living. But these all exist in nature. Nature is also the outside world. Safe. We have safe here. Safe is something is safe. There is no danger. And what this image is, this is an image of a turtle's shell. A turtle used to live here. It was safe when it was alive. It died, hopefully of old age, right? The turtle, the shell kept it safe, but all things die. All things grow. They get bigger. Eventually, all things will die. That's part of the life cycle. So this shell, while the turtle was alive during its life, it protected the turtle. It kept it safe. To keep something, to keep something safe. We can say this shell kept the turtle safe. If something is safe, there is no danger. He's safe. No danger. Don't worry. Okay, we've talked about living things and non-living things. Here we have another word, alive. Alive is associated with living things. Being alive means to be living, not dead. Okay, so here we see this fish. This fish is alive. It's moving around. Looks like it's breathing. So it is alive. But this fish will grow older. It, it has a cycle of life. All living things have the cycle of life. Someday this fish will die. And then when it dies, it will not be alive. So alive is the opposite of dead. These words are opposite. Alive, opposite, dead. And living things go through this. Living things are either alive or they are dead. Okay? Lesson 2. Living things versus non-living things. Living things. Living things need water, air, and food to live. Animals and plants are living things. Non-living things. Non-living things do not need water, air, and food. Rocks and water are non-living things. Environment. An environment is the place where a living thing lives. Survive. Survive means to continue living. A living thing needs water, air, and food to survive. Grow. Grow means to get bigger. If you have food and water, you will grow. Rock. A rock is a small and hard non-living thing. Nature. Nature is the world of living and non-living things. Safe. If something is safe, there is no danger. Alive. Being alive means living, not dead. <laughs>